Hello YouTube, I'm Mustafa Fridu from YouTube and I'm back with another video. So the video already got 31 likes, so now I have to release its tutorial. So it's nothing pretty uh, difficult. So we need a green screen, but not physically. That's why I told that it was uh, a different technique used in the video. So let's see what are we going to use. And you're going to need KineMaster for this video. That you have to remember, okay? I'm telling you from now. And those people who are asking that KineMaster is not allowed, no, I mean not available on iOS devices, you can find it. You go to App Store and search for KineMaster and download it. And that's how you download it, okay? There's no link. You go to App Store and download it. And for Android user, you already know you can download it from anywhere Play Store, One Mobile Market, or any other stuff for downloading stuff. Okay, so now head over to your computer and uh, find a green picture. You can search for green screen in Google. You can find a blank page or any other screen that is a bit big. So I have a green screen ready in my home. Now you can see. And if you have got like a dark problem, uh, I mean your subject is dark, so you can use external lights, I mean any flashlight or something to bright up your things. Now go to KineMaster and first of all choose the, you know, media option and then you can insert the photo but uh, due to somehow I could not find the photo that I used in the video, I will show you this photo. So it works with any now you can add oh i'm sorry click layer and click on effect and then you can go to the blur so now you can blur and by blurring i mean like we want a bokeh to be made so it looks like a dslr and then we can add new media and after that we can now we have to click on this one and uh, add some filters and do some color correction because I have to match this with the green screen footage okay so now we can just do this and then we can add the video and the great thing is that you can do something else you can make your background you know a video so it looks more alive but I used a photo as a background that's not so good but this can surely show you how this green screen method works so now that you know that I didn't use any green screen cloth or any paper chart or something I didn't buy anything I used my computer screen and that's a free green screen okay so it's good and then you can just go and enable this. I like to see this in the uh, black and white because I can know if it's full white, then I'm all right. Yeah, all right. Okay. Now you can see that. However, there will be some problems like, you know, there are green reflection on my hand. And from that, you can know that I use something that uh, reflects the light of the green screen. But you can use some lights, you know, from top, from the sides and everywhere. So it ends the light power of the screen. And that would be much good. Now you can see my hand is not so bright. But you can do that. And I just wanted to show you how to do this. So that's for you guys. So I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this. Peace out.